KSJFM 101.1 St. John's. Good afternoon, I'm Andy Newman with Coast Local Headlines. RCMP in Central has two men in custody that they say were committing a major credit card fraud in the province. The two, one age 23, the other 25, were targeting large and small shops, buying gift cards with stolen credit cards. RCMP has been tracking the pair since they arrived in Port of Basque in late February. Store owners are asked to contact the RCMP in Grand Falls, Windsor, if they have any more information or have been victims. Circle. K okay, gas cards. Contest closes April 3rd. Details in store. It's 857 on the coast. We're three minutes away from 9 o'clock. If you're traveling on the Ring Road, both lanes now uh, open on the Ring Road eastbound following that two, uh, multiple car collision. Uh, Topsail Road and Thorburn Road area this morning. So heads up. Uh, that uh, is still emergency equipment still on the scene there, but uh, they do have the highway opened up. But uh, a slowdown earlier today. This RDF is going to stick with us. It is. We're going to have uh, temperatures mild today. Five degrees. Overnight down to one. Two for tomorrow with some cloud and maybe some showers or flurries for Thursday in two degrees. They weren't kidding when they titled their album Living in a Fog. WGB coming up in the next half hour. Paul McCartney, Don Henley, and now Sass Jordan. This is Rescue Me on the Coast. Andy and Carolyn, mornings on the coast. Classic hits to start your day. 70s, 80s, 90s. Classic hits. Coast 1011. Up in the morning and out to school. School info on the coast for the Avalon Mall, where choice is everything. Like them on Facebook for information on mall events, sales, and contests. No school for students in Amalgamated Academy, St. Paul's Junior High, Holy Family Elementary, Holy Redeemer, Holy Cross Junior High, All Hallows Elementary, Beaconsfield Junior High, and Booth Memorial. It's Professional Development Day in those schools. Kindergarten students won't have kindergarten for Lark Hall Academy in St. George's because of a kinder start session. Skiing and snowshoeing outing to Pippi Park for Bishop Field has been canceled canceled today. McDonald Drive Junior High sending report cards home with students. Mom and Dad Optus available to you after three to book your parent-teacher appointment. Prince of Wales Collegiate Share the Spirit campaign is happening this week. It wraps up today. St. Bond's Monthly Recycling Blitz is tomorrow and the deadline for lunch orders next week Wednesday. Our website has school info for you anytime. You'll find us at coast1011.com. It is cloudy and one degree. Good morning. I'm Carolyn Moore with Coast Local Headlines for the Holiday Inn. Book early and save at HolidayInn.com. Some conditions apply. Noon today is the deadline for anyone interested in running for the leadership of the Provincial PC Party. Cornerbrook businessman Frank Coleman will be filing his papers today. John Ottenheimer is also considering running. Other possible candidates have opted out, including Steve Kent, Sean Skinner, and Derek Daly. Bill Barry has been confirmed. This is Precision Weather Meteorologist Phil Spivak for Coast 1011. Cloudy skies and one degree. Paradise is an amazing little town until you try and leave. <laughs> it's like the Hotel California. You can check in, you can't check out. Okay. Uh, and this is not an issue with Paradise. This is the lights topsail at Commonwealth and Mount Pearl. They're flashing, and it's backed up, backed up, backed up. So if you're coming out of Paradise on uh, Topsail Road and you normally head down Topsail to get to work, my suggestion, hit the outer ring and come up the butt end of whatever road you need to be on because uh, it's really, really slow there because of those lights. And they've been out since about 3 o'clock yesterday afternoon. Uh, Some other lights, uh, Topsail of Coruscant and uh, Torbay Road at Wedgwood Park, all the lights are out there as well. So that's really what's slowing you down and potholes as well. Do watch for them. There's going to be more too as the ground freezes later today. 754-1011. You can reach us if you have a tip for coast all day traffic. This half hour going to give away our final pair of hockey tickets for tonight's game. Ice caps go for 10 in a row they take on the pirates getting kids up dressed and out the door to school is a daily challenge it's a whole lot easier listening to nathan and carolyn i recognize burnouts when i see them class is now in session mornings on the coast Cloudy periods this evening, 14 overnight. Tomorrow's high, 24, looking pretty good with sunny periods and sunny breaks forecast for Sunday in the high near 20. A few fog patches still clicking around this afternoon and overcast skies, which should clear. Temperature is 14 degrees at St. John's Airport. The Avalon's best music continues with you, too.
Classic Hits Coast 1011, Hootie and the Blowfish should hold my hand. It's Rod Stockley. Pets on the bed on cold nights in particular, but anytime. A lot of pet owners are in the yes, let them on. Does it change your life when there's two in the bed and then there's a pet or two <laughs> in the bed with you? Sure it does. But, you know, love Fluffy and Fido, and there they are. Almost half of pet owners have their pets on their bed. But when it's been as cold as it has been the last few days, sure, welcome addition to the warmth on the bed. And you know what? Sharing your bed with the dog, honestly, it's really not up to you if you don't close the door. It's 401 Sports next. Envision the most relaxing and comfortable spaces in your home. More than anything else, your home is a reflection of who you are, and Saunders Bath and Kitchen Gallery can make your vision reality. Pamper yourself with Thermal Massage, the best massage a bath can give. Retire with Ban Ultra, a bath for better living, or indulge in the ultimate bathing experience of Acroline. Feel healthy, feel fully alive. Let St. John's Premier Bathroom and Kitchen Showroom show you how to feel comfortable. Visit Saunders Bath and Kitchen Gallery's new location, 234 Black Marsh Road. Now, Hall of Canada has heard that George Street is one of the best spots to party, and now we have a chance to prove it and to show our support for Newfoundland's very own Jason Greeley. It's all happening at Prince Edward Plaza on George Street at 6 o'clock. It's free, so be sure to head down and check it out. In the Coast Community Matters Mitsubishi for Islander RV, I'm Bill Pope for Coast 1011. Coast 1011. Just after one on the coast with you too. I still haven't found what I'm looking for. What's going on this afternoon? I'm Mike Belbin. Days are going to be getting longer starting tomorrow. Daylight savings time will happen overnight tonight before you head to bed. Set your clocks ahead one hour. Here's Carly Simon. You're so vain on the coast. The 70s greatest hits. And you don't even need an 8-track player. It's an 8-track flashback. From Coast 101.1. I'm Joel North with your Coast Local Headlines. Government satisfaction has hit 57%. The first time in over a year, it's above the halfway mark. Three months ago, that number was just 42%. A new CRA poll shows that if an election were held today, the Liberals would have 53% voter support, Conservatives would get 33%, and the NDP would come in at 13%. NDP leader Lorraine Michael, who was once the most popular party leader in the province, has dropped to least popular. Tom Marshall is sitting in second place for making the best premier. Dwight Ball holds the top spot. Hi, I'm Bill Sharp with Cool Jazz on the Coast. Tune in this Sunday from 9 to 12, and you'll hear some great jazz and R&B music. I've got a few songs from the 2013 recording Sinatra Duet's 20th Anniversary in the Sinatra Session. I feature some 2014 Juno-nominated music, and I've got a set of great tunes to take on a tropical vacation. Classic Hits Coast 101.1, Police Every Breath You Take. Alan here for your coast home. It's 504 coast all day traffic with Atlantic Home Furnishings your local source for appliances bedding, furnishings and flooring. This Friday drive home is going really well. There was an accident like a couple hours ago. What a great time to have an accident because I got cleared out and that was the end of that. Pitts Memorial Drive and the Outer Ring Road both moving quite well. Just a couple of slowdowns in town and it looks as though the uh, TCH is slowing down just as you get past the Cloverleaf. Maybe a few people trying to head out of town in the merge lane there. Otherwise, it looks really nice. If you do see something you'd like to add to Coast All Day Traffic, give me a buzz at 754-1011 and find the Coast on Twitter at Coast1011. Here's Abba with Waterloo. Classic hits, Coast1011. If you love getting out for some thrift store finding, well, let me tell you, the Beagle Paws Thrift Store is open noon till 4 p.m. Tuesdays through to Saturdays. You can drop on in, check out their great selection of brand new items. They're located at 33 Simmons Avenue next to St. Pat's Bowling. And when you shop there, is a good thing all of the proceeds go to Beagle Paws. If you've got something for Community Matters, send it in to onair at coast1011.com. 
CKSJFM, 1011 St. John's, 1075 Clarenville, Coast 1011. Coast Sports, the Newfoundland Growlers have lost some of their firepower as both Zach O'Brien and Marcus Power, both St. John's natives, have left the team and announced they'll be playing in Germany next season. And Ottawa has been awarded the 2021 Men's World Curling Championship by the World Curling Federation and Curling Canada. Classic Hits Coast 1011. It is 837 with Dylan Carolyn. Up to 16 degrees right now. Lots of sunshine out there. Oh. Man, it looks so nice. Just want to throw a blanket out of the front lawn there and just do the show from out there. It's certainly warmer out there than it is in my room. <laughs> Here's Elton John, Coast 1011. Classic Hits, Coast 1011. Carolyn, you can whistle just like that. I can. You are an awesome that is whistler. Me. It wouldn't surprise <laughs> me at all. Summer 1968, Otis Redding is sitting on the dock of the bay. It's 950 with Bill and Carolyn. Right now, some sunshine. It's 1119 is our high today. Success. You found somebody. Yep, I did. Found this guy feeding French fries to the seagulls across the street. Okay. And uh, went over. Very approachable. Very nice guy. Come on in. Come on in. Don't be nervous. Just uh, sit down here. I know microphones are probably uh, a little cause some, a little bit of anxiety. See, I and can't stuff. see anything L- because of the scary. computer yeah. monitors. A little scary. Yeah. Inter- Hi. Hi, guy. Just How are you? Introduce yourself to the people. Um, I'm Tony Angelo. Tony Angelo. How are you? I'm doing grand. How are you? I'm doing all right. How would you feel about, you know, coming in and hanging out with me early in the morning before the sun comes up? I I think that'd be cool. I learned today that five o'clock actually happens more than once a day. Yes, Yes, there is an a.m. Yeah. And a p.m. Yeah. Yeah. I think that'd be fun. I'm a pretty good judge of character. Yeah. I think this guy can probably handle it while you're gone for a week. Seems natural. Yeah. I've... Pushed a couple of buttons here and there, so yeah, I, that's I, good. I think, yeah. I think I could do it. I, I'm very confident that that you're going to be able to to ease your way right through this week. You you won't notice anything until the end of the week, and you're completely sleep deprived. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> well, I'm glad you have confidence in me. That's I do. You probably have more confidence in me than I do. So. All the confidence <laughs> in the world. Coast 101.1.